thứ thì when I was child uh, my uh, family very poor and they have uh, a lot of debt and uh, I think without uh, Jesus knowing Jesus I will be in the same danger like the other children but it was the church that reached this family in crisis when my parents became a Christian they learned uh, uh, the Bible and they learn that they have to love the children and love everybody and they know it's a sin uh, to sell the children so that's why they don't sell me now from her classroom at New Hope Yim helps other children hers is one of five New Hope school Yim's classroom floats on a riverbank where poor and stateless families live not wanted by Cambodia or neighboring Vietnam she says since putting the children into this class and working with their parents to help them see their potential, she has only lost three of the students to the sex trade. These are literally the kind of precarious steps being taken to reach these children that are at such great risk. I'm in between two floating classrooms here run by New Hope. And the strategy is that if you can offer free schooling to children who are stateless, unregistered, that you can begin to show the beauty and the potential of what children were meant to be. So the work for Cambodia's vulnerable children continues, training pastors to break up brothels, trauma care in secluded shelters, giving jobs and an alternative paycheck to girls who are pressured to provide for their families, legal work to back up this Cambodia assault on sex trafficking. Everyone agrees it's one child at a time, one family at a time. You've got to get at hearts that are transformed to say, you know what, there's something morally wrong about what I'm doing. Now, it's hard to imagine that from Western cultures that you wouldn't think that selling your children or using the women and the children in a, in a community to uh, produce income through such a, a horrible means, you wouldn't think that there would be a morality issue or question there, but this is a community where that's, that's the case they need to be shown and, and, and have the light turned on to see the dignity and the value and uh, you know just the beauty in every individual from child to adult. And while these children pray for a beautiful life and loving family, I get ready to head home. My missionary tour guide Kim will stay and work on the root of the problem. I need at first people pray for us in here. Uh, for the protection of the girls and also more people come here to to share the gospel because only with the gospel can change people's heart nothing can change the the parent heart only when they know christ they know it's a sin to sell their children